Good morning, children. Welcome back to Tamilian English class. How are you all? Hope you are doing great. Today we are going to look at some of the phrases that we can use in our daily communication. Okay, you need to know many phrases only that you can have better communication, right? So let us learn some of the. Okay, what are the usual phrases that you need to uh, speak English? Yes, if suppose you want to ask your parents to get you some water or pen or pencil, you can say. Get me a pen. Can you get me a pen, Papa? Can you get me a pen, or can you buy buy me a pen? Okay, you can either ask, can you get me a pen, or can you buy me a pen? Okay, can you get me a pen, or can you buy me a pen? Okay, clear. These these are all very necessary uh, phrases that you need to know. Okay, take a bath. Okay, enough watching TV, enough study. Go and take a bath. Okay, stop playing. Go and take a bath. Parents, parents can ask your children. Stop. You can ask your children to stop whatever they are doing, and you can ask them go and take a bath. How do you ask? Go and take a bath. Now, those of you who are listening to me, you should ask from here after. You must ask your children to take a bath. Stop playing. Go and take a bath. Stop playing. Go and take a bath. Stop reading. Stop studying. Go and take a bath. Clear. This is very useful phrase that you can learn. Take a bath. Then again, you can look at have a cup of water. Have a cup of water. Okay. If if the child is going on studying, going on playing, and he has uh, drunk some water, then you can ask. You must ask your child have a cup of water. Have a cup of water. Then have some food. Okay. You know. Please have some food, and we'll uh, walk out and uh, do something. Okay. So please have some food. Have some food. Have some food. Have a cup of water. Have a cup of water. Take a bath. Take a bath. Be fresh. Take a bath. Tell, uh, get me a pen. Get me a pen or buy me a pen. Clear? So these are very useful phrases that you must know. And let us learn a few more. Yeah, good trade. Okay, okay. Let's go and watch a movie. Let's go for the party. Get ready. You can ask your children. Get ready. You can ask your parents also. Get ready. Come, let's go and watch a movie. Get ready. Okay. How do you ask? Ask your parents. Ask your brother or sister. Get ready fast. We are going for a movie today. Okay. Get ready fast. Today we'll have a dinner out. Okay. Get ready. Okay. Get ready. So you must use. This phrase and construct more sentences. Get ready. It's time. Get ready. Come, let's go. Right. Wake up. Wake up. Suppose your child is going on sleeping till eight o'clock, and you want to wake him up. You can ask him. Wake up, Johnny. Wake up, David. David, wake up. Or Harry, wake up. You can ask your child to wake up when you want him to get up. Okay, clear. Then keep quiet. Keep quiet. If if the child is going on yelling at you, or you your brother is yelling at you, then you must ask your brother keep quiet. Or you can ask your uh, someone disturbing you. You can ask him keep quiet. How do you ask? Keep quiet. Okay. Speak loudly. I can't hear you. Speak loudly. You have to speak loudly. Okay. Speak loudly. Please. Okay. E neat and tidy. Keep your fingers. Neat and tidy. How do you ask your uh, if you ask your brother or sister or parents? Keep your fingers neat and tidy. Keep your uh, room neat and tidy. That means you should be neat and tidy. Okay. Wash your hands. Wash your hands before and after me. You can ask your parents or you can ask your brother or whenever you want to say. Wash your hands properly. Wash your hands before and after me. Clear. Wear your dress. Okay. Suppose you are standing naked. You can ask. Yes, wear your dress. Okay, wear your new dress. So this is a, a word that we can use. A word, wear. What is the word that we use? Wear. Wear your dress. Wear your T-shirt. Wear your uh, whatever. Okay. Then go to bed. Suppose you are watching the TV, watching the TV uh, late at night. Then you can ask. Okay, go to bed. It's time. Go to bed. It's too late. Go to bed. Okay, go to. Bed, go to bed means go to sleep. That's all. So, neat and tidy. Wash your hands. Wear your dress. Go to bed. Get ready. Wake up. Keep quiet. Speak loudly. Have some food. 
हाउ ए कप ऑफ वॉचर ठीक है बाद गेट मी ए पेन और बाय मी ए पेन ऑल दिस आर फ्रेजेस ऑल दिस आर शॉर्ट सेंटेंसेस दैट यू शुड लर्न एंड यू शुड मेक योर कम्युनिकेशन बेटर ओके क्लियर वी विल सी इन द नेक्स्ट क्लास टिल देन टेक केयर बाय बाय